The opinions expressed in the video you are about to see are solely those of BoatTest.com and its test captain. Captain Bob Smith, Director of Testing. Fairline is world renowned for fresh designs, sporty performance, and solidly built motor yachts. I'm Captain Rob Smith with BoatTest.com. The Targa 44 Gran Turismo was purpose built to take advantage of the IPS drive systems. Join me on board and let's see how well the Targa 44 Gran Turismo measures up to these lofty goals. The 44, like its four other siblings in the line, are modern express cruisers with a fine eye for performance, sleek, elegant styling, and luxurious accommodations fit to entertain large groups or as an intimate escape for you and your mate. From the electric sliding roof to the bright, inviting interiors, the 44 Gran Turismo is designed for a grand time. The generous swim platform is both spacious and functional with a concealed swim ladder, large stern storage box, and 12-volt outlet to use for an inflator for your water toys. A handy quick connect outlet and swim shower are in the wall at the port side transom walkthrough. The first indication of strength and construction is the safety railing around the sun pad with its solid block of wood and heavy duty hardware. As you will likely spend the majority of your time on board here in the cockpit entertaining, most of the interesting features that we're going to find on board are right here, so let's take a look. The large teak table can be folded in half for more room and is mounted on a large swivel with the starboard side or aft position. Whether you want to prepare hot hors d'oeuvres or a full alfresco meal, the cockpit galley feature will be a popular one. The solid teak top covers a grill, sink, refrigerator, and ice maker. One of the features I don't often see is this. This storage box actually has chill plates built into it, so your drinks are right at the ready for everybody on board. The aft seat back drops with the push of a button, creating a large sun pad to enjoy at anchor. Overhead in the hardtop, you have shades to cut down on direct sunlight when you prefer. You may not spend much time in the engine room yourself, but as a professional mariner, I really appreciate some things that I'm seeing in here. For one, the IPS drive system really opens up the space inside. They haven't tried to rob that space and use it in the interior as I've often seen the case. All the lines are well led and well organized and everything is easy to get to for you or the mechanic that may service your engines. The IPS drives combined with the Volvo IPS 600 engines leaves much room inside for the generator, tankage, and service points to easily be accessed by the captain or you. One of the special features on board the Targa 44 Gran Turismo hardtop is the forward half of it. It's electrically driven and it has a pneumatic seal. This pneumatic seal will prevent it from rattling when it's partially open and when it's closed it will prevent any water leakage. The introduction of Volvo's joystick command makes every operator a pro. This simple joystick takes advantage of fly-by-wire technology and computer-controlled inputs to simplify docking and close quarters maneuvering. Topside accommodations, of course, include the aft cockpit that we've just seen, a short step up to the forward cockpit, and if you want to enjoy the port side lounger, it's a rather large step up. But what that large step does is afford you a good view forward, plenty of room for several other people to join you, or for one to lounge back and relax. As you can see, you have a lot of room topside for entertaining guests and dignitaries, but oftentimes you're also going to want to do some entertaining inside. Let's take a look at the features inside and see how they measure up against Fairline's quality and standards. Inside, you and your guests will be able to relax in comfort. There's two berths on board. In this case, we have the day head that serves as the head for the guest room with its own separate entry. The guest cabin is set up for an easy change from two twins to a single double. This is often one of the most cumbersome things to do on board when you have guests. In this case, you release the latch underneath and swing it over and it automatically puts the bracing under the bed. This is the simplest system I've ever seen. The owner's cabin has a queen size island bed with storage underneath. You have the closets, the TV. One thing you'll notice is that the door does swing tight to the bed. But the value of that is that it pushes all the additional space into the cabin where you're going to use it more often than you would here in the room. You have a separate entry into a private head with an enclosed circular shower, vanity with the same cover that you have in the guest bedroom so that you can expand your vanity top when you're not using the toilet and open it up. The majority of the space in the cabin is dedicated to the salon. 
As you can see here, we have a large screen TV facing the settee. This whole area is open into the galley, which expands the space available. As you notice when you come in, you have a large wood rail, very solidly built, very solidly put together. The stairs turn into the salon so that it gives you more space. If they came straight down, you would fill in more space in the salon itself. Let's take a look at some of the individual features within the salon and galley. With the open floor plan, cooking can become part of the entertainment and the beautiful solid surface counters become a show place for tasty treats and beverages when entertaining inside. The lounge is a comfortable spot to observe a video or just relax with a glass of Merlot at night. Now obviously with a boat that's an entertainment platform, you're going to be bringing a lot of goods on board. You need to have a lot of storage space. Although I haven't shown you all the storage on board, this is an example of how they've taken care of storage by using all the available spaces. This actually lifts out so that when you need to have access to the pumps and the drains, you can still have access, yet it's usable space for storage when you don't have to get to it. From bow to swim platform, the Targa 44 measures 43 feet 3 inches with an overall length of 44 feet 11 inches. Across the beam, she measures 13 feet 3 inches. This model weighs approximately 11.12 tons and has a fuel capacity of 219 gallons. Engine choices are either twin Volvo IPS 600 D6 435s or Volvo IPS 500 D6 370s. I've had but a few minutes to take you through this world-class builder's Targa 44. Now it's time for you to set up your appointment for your own objective analysis.